She said that Donald Trump turned the U.S. into Saudi Arabia's prostitute. This is going to be the future head of our national intelligence. In Congress, Tulsi criticized criticized Trump's authoritarian strike against Qasem Soleimani. Now, I will remind you, he was considered the master of death in Iran. She said he had no justification whatsoever for killing him. She tried to limit Trump's war powers against Iran. She tried to cut our annual defense budget so that we couldn't punish Iran and hinder their influence. Reminder, Iran is our number one sponsor of terrorism, and Tulsi Gabbard was defending Iran. She went to Syria in 2017 for a photo op with Bashar al-Assad while he was massacring his own people. She said she was skeptical that he was behind the chemical weapons attacks. Now, this to me is disgusting because, Cheney, you and I were at the United Nations when Assad did those chemical attacks on those children. Yep. And you can go back and look at a speech I gave holding up pictures of dead children who had been killed by chemical attacks. Yep, choked to death. For her to say that Assad was not behind that. Literally, everything she said about that were Russian talking points. Every bit of that. That was Russian propaganda. After Russia invaded Ukraine, Tulsi Gabbard literally blamed NATO. Our Western alliance that's responsible for countering Russia, she blamed NATO for the attack on Ukraine. And the Russians and the Chinese echoed her talking points and her, her interviews on Russian and Chinese television. Tulsi Gabbard pushed for dropping charges against WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange and pardoning National Security Agency contractor Edward Snowden, both whom were accused of leaking highly sensitive U.S. secrets that put Americans in danger. She called for Trump to end the destructive war, trade war, with China. So now she's defended Russia, she's defended Syria, she's defended Iran, and she's defended China. Now, she has not denounced any of these views, none of them. She hasn't taken one of them back. DNI, Department, Department of National Intelligence, this is not a place for a Russian, Iranian, Syrian, Chinese sympathizer.